Welcome to GME TV, where we highlight some of the hottest artists around, from models, musicians, comedians, club owners, you name it, we highlight it. And I'm your host, Antoine, and we coming at you live at GME TV, AOS, where you at, baby? GME TV, baby. It's your boy Antoine right here live, live, live on Lexington Street at Lexington Market. You know what I mean? If you look up there, world famous Lexington Market, 1782, that was the year that Lexington Market had first originated right here in the streets of Baltimore. So that's an important piece for its history. And not only that, but Lexington Market is uh, one of the most continuous markets from six to seven generations. So you're talking about a lot of history, a lot of culture amongst people in Baltimore, you know, natives and beyond. So people know from out of town and beyond what it is about Lexington Market. So look it up, Google, go on your iPhones, your tablets, whatever you need to do and check out the history of Lexington Market because that's Baltimore, straight Baltimore, and support that. We right here, Lexington Market, GME TV. Let's run this video. Shout out to Emmy Ego Productions. Yeah, run this video, GME TV. We be back. Ah, man. Hey, wait, you see these niggas, G? I see that dummy. <laughs> Look at this nigga, man. Uh -huh. I know he ain't gonna do it. He gonna try. No, yo. He gonna this do nigga it. He's not about to jump off that damn porch. I guarantee you, he about to try. Not when we walk around with these things on us like this, G. He 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 <laughs> I know this nigga. I know this nigga see the thing. He's a tough guy, man. If this nigga do what I think he about to do, man, it's about to get real crazy. The boys say they want problems. I ain't hard to find yeah. it. Jump to my side of town. Yeah. We get it crackin' all year. Yeah. Jump off that porch, yeah. nigga. 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 Yeah. The boys say they want problems. Yeah. We ain't hard to find yeah. it. Jump to my side of town. Yeah. We get it crackin' all year. Yeah. Jump off that porch, yeah. nigga. 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 That AK, that AR. My mom's burgin' at 45 My young boys is ready to ride Y'all young boys be ready to die This chest not checkers, nigga Frontline and I'm here, nigga Took up years, but now I'm in So now let's get this paper, nigga Now mask up and let's move out Switch jobs, got a new route Family straight, the only thing that pleases me Gettin' that dope cheese, make me hard to leave me Family ties, we up in this bitch Turned up, we gon' hammer this bitch Tones off, we got burners in this bitch Stoked up, we gotta learn this bitch Frontline soldiers When it comes to the channel, we tryna get rich if your pockets are giving shit chips Bitch ass niggas you bout to get hit My nigga If you don't come up that porch We bout to come up there and give it to each and every one of you on the porch Gage out dummy Fuck that shit that you be talking about You know you not about that life You never should've run your mouth Dummy Now them young boys gotta deal with we got a little treat for y'all. We got some of the hottest dancers that ever stepped in Baltimore. And we, you about to see it right now. Not later, but right now. Play that. Musa, play that. Right here, GME TV, right now. Hottest. I'm stung, I'm stung. I'm stung. 
I'm stoner, I'm stoner, I'm stoner. I'm stoner, I'm stoner, I'm stoner. I'm motherfucker. I'm stoner, I'm stoner, I'm stoner. I'm stoner, I'm stoner, I'm stoner. I'm stoner, I'm stoner, I'm stoner. I'm stoner, I'm stoner, I'm well, we highlight some of the hottest artists around, you already know. Right here, live at Lexington Market. Y'all already seen the hottest dancers and all that. <laughs> that was funny, man. What? Hey, we here with Lyricism, man. What's up with you? What's going on, everybody? Shout out to Baltimore. Shout Had out to Baltimore. Long coming, man. Yeah, long you had that Lyricism Volume 1. Now yeah. you working on that Lyricism Volume 2, volume man. Two. It's the newest mixtape I got out right now, Lyricism Volume 2. Go ahead and get your copy on datpiff.com. And uh, if you see me in public, I always got a copy on me, so. Oh, yeah. So so what should we expect from uh, Volume 2 as opposed to Volume 1? On Volume 2, I just have, like, a, a different sound. I, I, I rapped over pop beats, house beats, uh, hip-hop, all types of music that's, you know, it just, it just it's a whole nother sound on there, man. Volume 1 was strictly hip-hop. Volume 2 is just, a, you know, a mainstream down to the grittiness of, of real hip-hop. Oh, that's what's up, man. So y'all getting it right here. So let me ask you this, man. Um, how long was the process for um, uh, working on this this mixtape, and um, what what did you uh, uh, feel like? What was the inspiration? I mean, I'm gonna start off with the inspiration. The inspiration was just um, listening to old school hip hop. You know, just constantly listening to Nas, Pac. Just trying to, you know, find my sound through, you know, my heart and my soul is where my music come from, of course. And, um, you know, it just, the process basically takes about a couple months. You know, I listen to some instrumentals and, you know, I just I just start writing. Start the writing process and record it and put it all together after that. So, it's you know, it's, it's, a, it's a pretty easy process, but, you know, all the music comes from, you know, a certain place in my heart. So, it's all real, you know what I mean? 1989 is when it all started. No picket fence, no big house, no dogs barking. Just urban living. Life was crazy. Had no idea where life would take me. My father's boy and my mama's baby. Prepared for this crazy world because of how they raised me. Life is hard, but I ain't complaining. I've been grinding lately. Been through the struggle, but rhyming right saved me. Grew up idolizing folks who were richer than I. That them same folks are trying to be bigger than. Make a couple million dollars with the pen. Without giving in. Stand out with the purpose to not fit in the trend. My mission being to become a legend. Listen in. To advice about wealth and progression Never have stepping Learning from past lessons Underground closets Studio raps all right, my next question to you, Lyricism, is pertaining to the history, uh, history period, hip hop. You know, the world famous Lexington Market, yeah. 1782, was yeah. the origination of it. So, um, how does the, the history of hip hop and you know Baltimore period relates to history? You know, well, Lexington Market, of course, everybody, you know, we all started going there when we were children. You know what I mean? It's, it's no doubt. There. You feel me? It's been there since the 1700s, and you know, back when horses and carriages were going around. So. You know, I can remember going there with my parents when I was little, getting a cheese steak or some pizza, listening to the live music, and that's that's you know that's powerful just to hear you know the live music, everybody getting engaged, you know, uh, to the music, and um you know it's it's just Baltimore period. You know, you can't you can't not live in Baltimore and not ever you know, have been to Lexington Market. So um you know that's that's just real. I love I love Baltimore and I love Lexington Market, man. Absolutely. I like it. Yeah, cuz I mean, I know I've got the cheese steaks and chicken wings, you know, when I was younger, you know what I mean? So, I mean, still, you know what I mean, every now and then I go in there and boom boom boom, you know, it, it, it's it, it's that feeling, you know, that Baltimore feeling. Definitely. I agree. Totally and, agree. And and you know, out of towners come here too. Yeah, I mean, it's tourists every weekend. It's tourists, man, whether it's, you know, bad weather or good weather, they want to see what Lexington Market is about. You know, that's one of our uh our trademarks other than the stadiums and you know, we got a lot of trademarks here, you know, but Lexington Market is the stamp. You want good food? You want, you know, good entertain entertainment? Come to Lexington Market, y'all. Come to Lexington Market. Now, let me uh, say this. I need the contact information, everything pertaining to, you know, you and the album so people can go get that, cop that. Yeah, you can, uh, my, as far as business goes, as far as um, doing shows goes, you can contact me on my business email. It's Malik Carter. That's M-A-L-I-K-C-A-R-T-E-R 25 at hotmail.com. I'm, I'm my own manager i handle all my own business so hit me up and we can make that happen uh this mixtape lyricism volume two you can find that on datpiff.com uh available for free download uh you can find my music on soundcloud.com datpiff hot new hip-hop youtube i'm on there too as well fan page is lyricism 
Um, and lyricism is spelled L I L R I C K C I S M. And uh, I'm on Instagram, official underscore lyricism, Twitter at lyricism underscore 54. That's everywhere on Google, man. Just put me in there and, and rock with me, you feel me? Word. So y'all getting it first from lyricism, authentic hip hop, authentic person, good music. Yeah, volume one, volume two's out. Y'all need to cop that. GME TV will be back. No doubt. Peace out, Baltimore. I love y'all. And we here right now. What's your name, brother? My name is Malcolm, Malcolm Lemon. Yeah, we here with Malcolm Lemon right now. And uh, we, we just out in the street like we always doing, man. So uh, what, what it is, tell us a little bit about yourself, man. We talking about Lexington Market, you know, 1782, you know, where it first originated. What's your take on that? Uh, Lexington Market, um, well, I was born and raised here in Baltimore. So Lexington Market is like like home, you know. Word. And uh, I really come down here to buy the uh, Caribbean American food on the corner, right here. Oh, word, word. What, yeah, what's the name of the spot? Uh, Caribbean American food. Okay, Caribbean American food. Shout out. Hey, that's what we do, Baltimore style, man. So, so uh, you down here buying the Caribbean food? How the food taste? Uh, it's real good, man. It's delicious, man. Oh man, I need to get down there and get Caribbean. I love Caribbean food. Shout out to Island Cuisine. Now, um, now I, I want to ask you, as um, far as the history of Lexington Market and being down here, what I mean, how how you feel about that? What what type of vibes? Well, Lexington Market, it's just it's just it's just home here, man. One of one of the parts of um, downtown Baltimore City, right? It, it's where all the black people meet at. You know what I'm saying? It's like it's a it's a it's a big big downtown city, and this is where you see the brothers sisters. Absolutely, and it's always good. It always good conversation. You know what I mean? You always get like people. You know what I mean? It, it, the the um the good and the bad, the beautiful, the ugly, whatever. You know what I mean? It's always something there to uh, the, the the to be inspired by. You know what I mean? Uh, and and what so like far as Lexington Market, 1782, this history. Um, what you think um in the future for Lexington Market right now? I, I don't know how the uh, the the structure of the financial uh, situation is down here, but uh, I, I know uh, it looks like it's still having a lot of business, and uh, a lot of people still come down here. So I, I think I think they're still making a whole lot of money. Word. Now, any special shout outs or anything? Anything you want to say to the, the the listening audience right now? Listening audience, uh, Baltimore is the best. <laughs> there you have it, Baltimore's the best. Well, say your name again, bro. Uh, Malcolm Lemon. Malcolm Lemon, right here, Baltimore the best, here on GME TV. You all say you bad, but this one is for the baddest one. So it's for her, you, and you, and you. And you, and you, and you, yeah, I'm up in here, baller of the year, MVP average triple double for the year, the reason why I'm here, I'm looking for a deal, my man says he, you can't find a wifey here, yeah, I'm in the club, looking for some love, you thinking that I'm stupid, I'm trying to see Cupid, what I want to see is how I'm Yes, sir. It wraps up another good show. Again, you know, GME TV, we always highlighting hot artists. If you got hot music, you're a hot artist, you got something to say, y'all need to holler at us. Holler at us at ghostmoneyent.com. Also, you can access us facebook.com slash ghostmoneyentertainment. Follow us on Twitter at ghostmoneyent.com. 